Hey guys, so today I showed you my mascara routine and how I get my real lashes to look like falsies. I rarely ever wear falsies because I have lashes and mascara that can make my actual lashes look like falsies. So as you can see, they are blowing a wind. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Oh so, yes, everybody always asks me if these are my real lashes, and yes they are. And I'm actually still in the process of growing them longer and thicker and stuff like that. And I just put a video up, I'll link it somewhere on the screen, on my Get Un Ready With Me video. And before going to bed, you guys saw me putting this on. And this is Jamaican Black Castor Oil by Sunny Isle. And what I do with this basically is every night before bed, I... You see my gross braid? Oh my god, it's so cute. Okay. So what I do with this stuff is I will put it on after I wash my face and I have no makeup on and everything like that. I'll use my fingers and I'll, there's a fly. I'll rub it on my eyebrows, on my eyelashes and everything like that. Like take it between my fingers and really get this stuff in my lashes. And this has helped my lashes to grow thicker and longer and it also helps so that my lashes don't fall out as much when I'm removing my makeup. I rarely ever have eyelash fallout anymore. And it also keeps my brows nice and thick. So yes, it does a lot of good things for me. So this helps with the growth and maintenance of my lashes. But the mascara routine I have helps my lashes look so freaking awesome. So just continue to watch the video if you want to see how to get your lashes full and beautiful. Okay, so we're first going to start by taking our eyelash curler. I think this one is from L'Oreal. And we're going to use this to pump on the eyelashes and just give it a lift and more volume. When you're using the eyelash curler, you don't want to just squeeze the curler together. You want to do little pumps and push it into the eyelid to give you more lift. Okay, so for this look, we're going to be layering mascaras, and for this look, I'm using four different ones. The first one I'm using is the L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara, and this is the waterproof version. And we're going to use this to give our lashes more thickness and more volume. Okay, so to apply the first mascara, you want to roll it first on top of the lashes, and you want to be careful not to get it on the lid. So if it helps, you can lean your head back. Once you roll it on top of the lashes, you want to put the mascara one at the base, base of the lashes and wiggle it all the way to the top. One thing you want to try not to do is keep dipping your mascara one back into the bottle. You want to just use one dip and use all of that mascara on your lashes to prevent your lashes from clumping up. So far, this is what the lashes look like with one coat of the Carbon Black Mascara. And now we're going to layer on another mascara, which is the Colossal Mascara from Maybelline. And this one just gives you a lot more volume. It doesn't do much for length, but it just gives your lashes really, really fat because it has collagen in it. You're just going to apply this in the same way we did the first mascara. You want to push a lot of it into the base and wiggle it all the way to the top. The reason that we're layering so many mascaras is because each mascara does a different thing to give a different effect to your lashes. So this is what the lashes look like after the second coat of mascara using the Colossal Mascara. And now we're going to move on to the third coat of mascara which is the Make Maybelline Mega Plush Mascara. And what this mascara is going to do is just going to make your lashes look very feathery and soft. It has a bendable, like flexible brush, so it kind of bends and moves with your lashes instead of just going right through them. And it also is made of this gel formula, so it's just going to make your lashes look really, really, really soft and feathery.
This is what the lashes look like after the third coat of mascara. Now we're going to move on to the last mascara which is the Rimmel London Glam Eyes Mascara. And we're just going to use this mascara to give us length and help separate the lashes. We're also going to use the Glamize Mascara on the lower lashes as well. So these are what the lashes look like after the final coat of mascara. As you can see they look a lot different from when we first started in the video. They have a lot more volume and also a lot more length and they're also very very dark which reminds you of false lashes. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you guys can utilize these tips and tricks on yourself. Don't forget to subscribe and also don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Stay Envious. And also don't forget to like my Facebook page. And if you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And also if you have any questions or anything like that, you can comment down below. So I love you guys and as always, stay envious and stay beautiful. Mwah.